The Earth has a 4.6 billion year history. However, Homo sapiens, modern humans, only evolved between 400,000 and 250,000 years ago. Human evolved from the family hominid great apes that have existed on Earth for around 20 million years. Over time, different human species with different characteristics have existed on Earth. But not all species have humans have survived the journey, with many of them becoming extinct. The only human species left is Homo sapiens. The idea of being linked to the apes came after the publication of Charles Darwin's On the Origin of Species in 1859. He was the first to point out that every species has emerged from an earlier one. Later two scientists, Thomas Huxley and Richard Owen supported him. Huxley published a book in 1863 entitled Evidence as to Man's Place in Nature. Even though scientists held several views and theories, the major problem was proof because there was lack of fossil intermediaries. Eugene Tobias discovered the first fossil intermediary in 1891 at Trinil in the Dutch East Indies, modern day Indonesia. Providing that there were species between humans and apes, he called these findings Pisacanthropus erectus or Java man. Additional fossils were discovered in Africa in 1920 and the study of the evolution of humans began thereafter. Here is the list of seven homo species that have existed on earth. Homo heidelbergensis lived on earth between 700,000 and 200,000 years ago. They emerged from Africa. The Homo heidelbergensis was about 5 feet 9 inch 175 centimeter tall and weigh around 62 kg. They had a large brain case with a flatter face than today's humans. They were the first human species to adapt to colder climates and to build their own shelters to live in. They were also widely known for their ability to hunt large animals which had not been seen in human species before then. The first Homo heidelbergensis fossil was discovered on October 21, 1907 by a worker in Germany. The workman handed it over to Professor Otto Skotenschek from the University of Heidelberg, who later identified and named the fossil. Homo rudolfensis is another extinct species that falls into the hominid category. They are believed to have lived around 1.9 million to 1.8 million years ago. Their physical build, weight and height is still unknown due to the scarcity of cranial fossils. Paleoanthropologist Mickey Licky and her team announced the discovery of a face and two jaw bones belonging to the Homo redolfensis on August 8, 2012. The fossil known as KNMER1470 was at the center of debate about its age. It was first thought to be around 3 million years old, but later this was corrected to 1.9 million. The difference in the skull from other Homo species led to the creation of a new species called Homo redolfensis. There are certain features of the ER1470 to suggest that it is not different from other homo species, such as the lack of heavy muscle, the crest of Australopithecine crania, and the smoothly rounded occipital bone, similar to that of a homo erectus. However, other key features suggest that homo redolfensis are different from other homo species, having much longer face with the upper part being narrower than the middle and with many more megadont post caninis.
Homo habilis was another species of hominids who lived on Earth between 2.4 and 1.4 million years ago. Homo habilis possessed some ape-like features such as long arms and a moderately prognathic face. They had a larger brain case in the range of 550 centimeter to 687 centimeter. However, they had a smaller face and smaller teeth. There has been some debate as to whether Homo habilis should be classified as Homo since they had very few characteristics of other Homo species. But scientists discovered that they had the capacity to use stone tools for various purposes. There are three key fossils available of Homo habilis KNM ER1813, OH24, and OH8. The first fossil was found by the scientists Lewis and Mark Ilicki at Olduvai George in Tanzania in the 1960s. Homo floresensis was believed to have lived from 95,000 to 17,000 years ago in Indonesia. They were quite small in size around 3.5 feet with a tiny brain. There is evidence that Homo floresensis made stone tools and used to hunt small elephants and rodents. The key fossil of Homo floresensis were found in 2003 in Indonesia and were named LB1. Perhaps their small body enabled them to survive on the small island with limited resources. Erectus is an extinct species of early human that lived throughout the Pleistocene period from about 1.9 million years to most recent 143,000 years ago. The first Erectus fossil was discovered in Java, present-day Indonesia, in the early 1890s by Eugene Dubais. The study of fossil proved that Homo erectus originated in Africa and spread through India, China, Georgia, and Java. Homo erectus were generally in the range of 4 feet 9 inch to 6 feet 1 inch with a weight of around 88 to 150 lbs. Their height and weight were different from the fossil found in other parts of the world. The fossil from Africa had larger body size than those of Indonesia, China and Georgia. Their elongated legs and short arms helped them climb trees easily and run faster than modern day human beings. Nethertail is an extinct species of human with the closest similarity to modern humans. Only 0.12% of their DNA is different to modern humans. The Neanderthal was believed to have existed from about 600,000 to 30,000 years ago and lived throughout Europe and Southwest to Central Asia. They had most of the features of modern humans. They used different tools for hunting and were symbolic ornamental objects. There is evidence that they used to bury their dead with offerings such as flowers. Some earlier human species that have also been found to have engaged with such symbolic behavior. A study has indicated that the Neanderthal and the modern human brain were similar at birth. However, in adulthood, their brains became larger. They were stronger than modern humans with a huge body size, 164 to 168 centimeters. Most hominid species that existed on Earth became extinct during climate changes, but Homo sapiens survived and became the ancestors of modern humans. Homo sapiens lived together, hunting food, and evolved to such an extent that they could cope with the climate changes that occurred. Besides hunting, they discovered how to propagate certain plants and how to breed animals. They changed history forever. Soon, they learned to produce more food and ate a variety of animals and plants. 
Their control over fire and their tendency to live in larger group also lead to the creation of better shelters. Scientists have found various fossils that supported strong evidence of Homo sapiens. The oldest known fossil were discovered in Hirto, Ethiopia. Researchers from the University of California found the skull of two adults and a child who lived around 160,000 to 40,000 years before modern times.